One key to a successful outdoor movie night is great audio. While you likely won't be replicating the quality of an indoor theater with seven surround sound speakers and a massive subwoofer, it is possible to create a great backyard audio experience very easily and quickly. In this video, I will share a few things to consider as you think about audio for your outside theater. Up until a few years ago, audio for an outdoor theater meant dragging bulky indoor equipment outside and running speaker wire across your yard. The solution created great audio, but it certainly wasn't very convenient or easy. Setup was frankly a drag. Today, there are numerous portable battery-powered speakers that do an amazing job for movie audio. These connect wirelessly to your content device or projector via Bluetooth and are very convenient. When considering different audio solutions, we want to think about your yard and audience size. The bigger the party, the more audio you'll need. Starting with small options, obviously you have many, many brands to choose from, but here are three popular models from a few leading brands. These options would be good for groups of six to 10 people. These are all wireless enabled and battery powered. They cost around $100 to $130. Size-wise, these are all about 750 to 950 cubic centimeters in volume. Next are medium-sized models. These are around 1400 to 1600 cubic centimeters, so roughly double the size of the small models. These are also wireless, battery-powered, and cost two to $300. These would be good for groups of about 10 to 20 people. The largest speakers are quite a bit larger, at 13,000 to 22,000 cubic centimeters. These put out so much audio, you had better make sure you invite the neighbors over for the movie. These are an investment at four to $600, but nicely fill your entire yard with great audio. These are appropriate for up to 20 plus people. For really big movie nights, you're gonna be looking at portable DJ equipment. This is professional level equipment that will fill a huge yard or small park. I won't go into details here about these options because frankly we could spend 20 minutes on just this, but suffice to say these involve an investment of about a grand or more. Depending on where you live, renting this equipment could be an option. In the next video we'll look at content devices and wirelessly attaching to these audio devices via Bluetooth.